Good morning, my knitting friends. One of the reasons I have taken to rucking with a weighted backpack, um, one, because my next door neighbor, one of my best friends and business partners got into it and I like doing things with her. Um, and she had done a whole lot of homework on the right backpack, making sure the weight was distributed evenly so it didn't hurt her back because she had some back issues. And she got into it. We work with Wild Gym. That's where we have these backpacks from. And I can get you information on it if you're interested. But one of the main reasons why I decided to do this was because when I am knitting, oftentimes I'm hunched over. My neck is down, I'm hunched over, my posture's not great. And I try to be aware of it, but I just slip into bad habits and start hunching over. So this backpack with weight on it, it's like why I love yoga. In yoga, we always say shoulders up, back and down, and we roll our shoulders up, back and down to give us good posture. This forces good posture. So my shoulders are up, back and down, and I knit yesterday for quite a long time, and I can feel it in my neck, my lower neck, a little bit today because it's trying to counteract what I did to it last night. So just food for thought. If you are hunched over a lot, something like yoga, uh, stretching, weighted backpack, weighted vest, when you walk are a great idea to help you with your posture and make sure you don't end up having some issues from being hunched over because you don't want that. You don't want to not be able to knit because you're experiencing neck and back pain and have to take a break. And I'll show you a little horse and buggy going by. <laughs> so there's my tip for the day. Have a great day.